I'm sorry, I'm going to have to blink here, um, that um, probably it's an eclipse. I think, I'm not sure how I feel about them, but I think they're quite important questions. Deep, difficult, kind, useful, insecure, powerful, contradictory, playful, serious. It feels very weird to not be able to answer a question about yourself, but there is no question, like, I don't know, my soul. I think they're quite difficult to answer because it's, it's a very analytical self-reflection that is not easy to produce quickly. As, as you said, uh, like the eyes are the window of my soul. <laughs> I can really feel my ego being asked that question, wanting to make myself brilliant. Soul, I don't think we have a soul. I think we're just animals and we die and that's it. All of us is gone. Finished. I just believe I'm a piece of meat with a circuit, a circuit how you call that, I don't know. Um, just wires, cables all over my brain, that's it. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I'm a horrible person, but yeah, I've been quite warm and kind. Um, and I don't know. I am a brave person and um, always full with surprises and I can surprise myself as well. Being put on the spot with these kind of questions is difficult. Um, and I'm sure if I had more time to think about it I'd give you completely different answers. A little bit awkward because I didn't really know what to say. Um, but interesting because it makes you think. Thinking about it, I, uh, I don't know really. I don't ever really think about it myself, but I do know that my personality does change because I probably am a lot more quieter, like for instance, at university than what I am when I'm with my friends or socially. It probably makes me question what layering I understand of myself. I haven't really dug very deep, dug. 